Hello. Today we are going to use navigation in Godot 4 to get an enemy to chase us. We will get the enemy to rotate towards us when it chases us. We have a ghost under models. I'll put a link below where you can download it from Open Game Art, or you can use another model. We will right click and create a new inherited scene. Then we will change the type to character body 3D and make a collision shape. We will add an animation player and give the ghost a simple bobbing animation. We will save the scene under Characters. We will go to our scene. We will add a navigation region. We will put the ground and the obstacles that we want the enemy to navigate through as children of it. We will add a new navigation mesh in the inspector. Under agents, we can define how tall the enemies are that we want to move, and the radius to know if there is enough room around something for them to move around it. We will bake the nav mesh. Save the scene. We will need a reference to the hero, so we will put him in the group hero. We will go back to the ghost and attach a script. Delete all of this because we won't need it. We will add hero as a var and turn speed as an export var with an initial value of 4. We will add the ready function. And under here we will put hero equals get tree. dot get nodes in group hero zero in brackets. This will get the first node in the group hero, which will be the only one. We will add a navigation agent 3D. Then under physics process, we will put navigation agent 3D dot set target position. Hero dot global transform dot origin.
then we will put var velocity equals, and we will put parentheses, navigation agent 3D dot get next path position. minus transform.origin will have dot normalized multiplied by speed multiplied by delta. Then we will put move and collide velocity. This will make the ghost chase us, but we also want it to turn towards us while chasing. We will add a node 3D and put it in front of the ghost. We will call it face direction. Turn the model 180 degrees. And under Physics process delta, we will add face direction dot look at. Hero dot global transform dot origin. Comma vector three dot up. Rotate Y, then in parentheses we will put deg to rad, face direction dot rotation dot Y, times turn speed. We will change the size of the ghost to 0.5. Sometimes you have to experiment on flipping the model to get it to go the right direction when chasing. Be sure to flip the model, not the character body 3D. One thing you may need to do with your enemies is go to Navigation Agent 3D and adjust the agent height offset to put your enemy on the ground if the origin of the model is in the center rather than at the bottom, so it is moving halfway through the floor. Also, the nav mesh is slightly above the ground, so if your enemy walks on the ground, you may need a slight negative offset. This won't be a problem with this enemy because it is a ghost and floats up off the ground. We will add the ghost to the scene. And now we have a ghost that chases us around and turns to face us wherever we go. Thanks for watching. If you found this helpful, please like, comment, or subscribe. Thank you.